Hello, world of YouTube. So it's been a minute since I made a video about anything, really, anything makeup related or skincare related, anything of that nature. <laughs> so I figured I'd make a really quick video about just a little Ulta haul that I have. I went to Ulta the other day to get, I really just went there to get one thing and I wound up getting a bunch of other stuff, but it is stuff that I really needed and stuff that I wanted to try. So... I'm going to go ahead and share this with you guys because, like I said, it's been a minute since I've uploaded a video about anything at all. <laughs> and I am not wearing any makeup. I'm giving my skin a break because I've been getting some breakouts, as you can see, on my chin and jawline. And it ain't... I'm giving the makeup a break. I can't. I just can't. So, the first product that I have is the Eco Tools Facial Mask Mates. I've been meaning to get my hands on this for my Glam Glow Charcoal Mask. I really love the Glam Glow Charcoal Mask, but it gets everywhere and it's super messy. So, I figured I would just get an applicator brush to properly apply it. And it comes with three little sponges. So, you don't have to use your face tiles. Face, face tiles. Face towels. Let me say it right. Face towels to get the mask off. All you have to do is just wet the sponge, take off the mask, and clean off the sponge. Next, I got another. I got another mask applicator brush from the I Do Care line. That is the Korean skincare brand, and I'm going to use this for my Clinique Take the Day Off uh, Makeup Removing Balm. The Makeup Removing Balm works so good, but it gets contaminated with makeup, it gets contaminated with foundation, because you're using your fingers, because unfortunately it does not come with a brush. So, I just got this little guy so that I can use it so that it doesn't get contaminated. And you can apply an even coat of your mask, or whatever type of mask you're using at that time. Next, I got um, this little bottle of tea tree oil from the Body Shop. I have been loving this tea tree oil so much. Um, you can mix it in with your moisturizer. It smells really good. It doesn't have like that super strong smell or that super harsh feeling. And it makes my skin feel so good, so soft, and like, uh, it just feels so good. It feels really good on skin. Um, next I got the Derma E Vitamin C Concentrated Serum with Hyaluronic Acid. Um, I've noticed that, uh, vitamin C serums or vitamin C products of any sort cost buku money and I ain't got $60 to spend on just one product. So this little guy was $20. I'm going to give it a try and see how it works for my skin. Let's see. It says it will... Where is it? Where is it? Where did I read it? Um, yes, it improves the appearance of... Oop! I think that was a mosquito. Um, my window's open. It uh, improves the appearance of uneven skin tone. And I have a little bit of hyperpigmentation and a little bit of blotchiness on the skin. So I'm going to give this a try and see how it uh, works with my skin. Um, it is cruelty-free, GMO-free, gluten-free, soy-free, recyclable, wind energy certificates. <laughs> so yeah, this is like all natural, which is awesome. Now on to the makeup. I got a little bit of makeup. Just a little bit. A little bit. A little bit. I got the Revolution Concealer because I needed a concealer that was not the same not the same color as my foundation. I don't know what that'd be. I, I don't know what I was thinking when I did that. I got this in the color C13. I got color matched by the lady at Ulta because she did say that concealer is supposed to be brightening. At first, I did not know that. I didn't know that at all. And now that I do know that, I'm like, okay, I need to get a brightening concealer for these under eyes. My under eyes are improving, by the way. Um, next, I got the Revolution Luxury Baking Powder in the shade Banana. This is the shade Banana, right? Yep, this is the shade Banana. Uh, people have been raving about that shade in particular. People of all skin types have been raving about Banana House. Not too dark, not too light, not too yellow, not too orange, not too cakey. Because I do know that if you use a white, it depending on your skin tone, it'll make you look kind of cakey. And I don't need to look cakey. <laughs> uh, 
And last but not least, I just got a simple lip liner from NYX in the club, in the club, in the color Club Hopper. <laughs> Um, I got this for when I wear my brown lipstick because I've been uh, loving the uh, NYX lingerie liquid lipsticks and I got the first one I got was in the shade birthmark and at first I did not like it but then I I'm like okay I need to get more confident wearing lipstick so I tried it on and I put a little gloss on top of it and I'm like oh okay you're giving me vibes you're giving me vibes so I really, really liked that and I was wearing it and it's like I got so many compliments on that lipstick. So yeah, that's pretty much everything that I got from Ulta the other day. Just wanted to do a quick little haul, a little five minute video on what I got. And yeah, so I'm probably not going to be making that many videos lately or, you know, coming soon. I'm probably not going to be making that many videos because I did stop getting Ipsy bags. I do have new makeup to show you guys. I was supposed to do like reviews and makeup tutorials on items that I did get, but things have just gotten so hectic and crazy that I haven't really had the time nor the energy to do those things. But I do want to try and do makeup tutorials or just get ready with me. Um, I'm going to try and do those, but the next like 25 days specifically the next 25 days are going to be really hectic and crazy for me because I'm going to be spending that time basically moving switching jobs you know going back and forth between here and where I will be living so it's going to be pretty crazy but I'm going to try to plan out some videos for when everything finally settles and I am settled and everything is just the flow is just going. I'm going to try and plan out some things to do for videos and such because I feel like I haven't posted in such a long time. And this is just a spur of the moment, simple, like not even like perfect video. I didn't really want to make this video just perfect. I just wanted this to make like a simple like almost live video. But yeah, I just wanted to make this video, show you guys what I got and... That's pretty much it and just, you know, give an explanation or just say what I'm going to be doing in the future. Um, but yeah, a lot is going to be happening soon within the next 25 days and then the month after that is going to be even crazier because we're going to be moving again to a bigger unit. So I'm going to be uh, ordering a vanity. I found one on Target's website that I really, really liked. So I'm going to be ordering a vanity and getting everything set up to where we, our second bedroom is going to be like a beauty slash game room because we both have Xbox Ones and he has an Xbox 360. I also have a Nintendo 64. So we're pretty much going to be turning into a beauty slash game room. Um, we're also going to be putting my bed in there because I want to take my bed with me. So if everything fits like I'm hoping it will fit, it'll be a really nice like sort of like beauty slash lounge slash game room. So yeah, we're going to pretty much be doing that. But um, I'm going to stop blabbering because this will turn into like a 30 minute video of everything that I'm going to be doing. But I mean, I may do a video once we like finally move to the bigger unit. Just to, like give you guys a walkthrough and whatnot. But yeah, that's pretty much what's going to be happening within the next 25 days to the next, I say, you know what, not even 25 days, two to three months. It's just going to be really, really crazy. Things are going to settle once I finally start the job, but then are going to pick back up again once it's time for us to move again. And basically the only reason why we're doing that is because his lease is going to be up um, at the end of August. So we're going to have to move into a bigger unit. So we're going to be having a year long lease. So that's pretty much all we're going to be doing. But um, yeah, I just wanted to make this quick little video and show you guys what I got and tell you what's going on. I'm going to go ahead and call it a night because I am seriously tired and my tummy hurts and I want to put this stuff away. So I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.